Your friend type just doesn't want to show up for work. He's like, I'll seriously just dial it in. I'll just literally phone it in. Anyway, welcome back everybody to another short stream. I'm still melting horribly and not feeling too good. Uh, because, you know, that's just the way my life is. Um, what else? Gonna be playing the new game, the Akogari Girl Collection, uh, Wanyan Pet Shop. Gonna see how that one is. I might swap off, uh, the animal hospital with the pet shop. You know, like, one here, one there. I, I don't know when I'll be getting back to dinosaurs and fishing. Probably when it actually turns fall and it's not like a billion degrees outside. Mm. <laughs> Sorry, migrating. What else? Um, and that's about it. Uh, let's see here. Let me get the game up and running. I managed to get it in. What is it? Um, uh, not display mode, this other mode, windowed mode. I guess Rujin's finally allowed you to play it in window mode. Anyway, switch to 16x9. Ren type. I already gave you a break. Switch to 16x9. Uh, why are you not showing up, Ren type? I'll debug him later. Anyway. It starts off exactly like the other game did. You have like a work mode and then you have a um... Tell me your first name. Tell, tell me your last name. Tell me your social security number. The game just, like, lock up on me? Oh, oh, wait. Wait a minute. Hold, please. It, um... Virgins has a thing where it pops under any kind of input field because, you know, that's exactly what you want to happen when you're in full screen mode is to have it pop under and not pop over. Anyway, let's let's test this. Will it accept it? No, of course it won't. One to eight characters! People's names are longer than that. Um, what do I usually get? those um can you hear me over the sound of the music because it's kind of loud for me if it's loud for me it might be loud for you determined sprout 
the same three hairstyles we had, like, started off on the other game. You know, I'm glad blue is, like, a default color. Blue, pink, and yellow. Green is not. Anyway, let's, uh, let's start our adventure of, uh... Let's see if it- hopefully it saves my, um... Hairstyle. It's the exact same music as the other game! Your first day at work at the pet shop in town. If you take the time to learn, you'll be the best employee ever! Let's start by pressing the pet shop button to go to the pet shop. I don't need realistic switch load times. And remember, I can check the locker to see if I my a uh, different color work uniform. This is the pet shop you'll be working at starting from today. Looks like it is running a little bit slow. Uh -huh. Yep, I am the Shinjin-san. Your name is literally Red Mai. Your hair color is literally red. Your apron is literally red. Are we sure this pet shop isn't a front for a Sentai team? You'll be like, oh, I'm selling puppies and kittens too! Oh no, the alarm's going off! I must transform! And, you know, there's some big monster of the week that we have to fight. Alright, hang on a sec. It's not like. Doesn't look like it's running at like. Uh. You know what? I'll put it down to like seventy five. running at native. Let me just put the, uh, upscaling to, um... Yeah, FSR is the nice one, but, like... All the graphics look like garbage. Sort of. Well, they look like standard Switch graphics, which is like, you know... Can't do anything. I can't do the nice thing. I set myself. <sighs> Andromeda Shun? Tell me it's Andromeda Shun. Oh. It's the hot, blue-headed one. 
君と同じ新人店員さん。The one that's replacing Yuma. そろったからお互いに自己紹介してもらおうと思って。I do like the um. I do like the uh, 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 um. Bokua, Shimizu, Shun. Yoroska. Mizu. Mizu is like, um. Mizu. Shizu. What am I thinking of? Never mind. Oh, it's cute. Kyokara, Kono Sanin de Petto Shop no Shimoto Steak, ya. I'm gonna adjust a few more things. You can tell between handheld and docked. And running at like 23 frames a second. This might actually be run better in like GL instead of Vulcan. Who knows? You know what? Handheld, but I gotta have some graphics here. I did. Wan Yang. I guess we're translating it as pups and turns. Although Wan is like bark. It'd be barkers and furs. Or barkies and furs. Or woofers and furs. Uh, what am I gonna say? I was saying I like the, the message boxes. I might steal it, even though, like, I got rid of mine. Yes. お仕事中はエプロンを着てもらうんだけど、着替える時はこの部屋を使ってね。中に二人のロッカーと着替えは用意してあるから、早速着替えてきてね。Oh, only the yellow work apron. Only oh, apron on your Well, at least it's yellow and not pink. It is acceptable. Of course, it gets the blue one. Give me your apron! And then I was fired for attacking the other chicken. Of course, of course, mine has pink on it, because you know. What is that look he's given? 
No, no, what would that look, dude? Wait, has it not updated? Oh, yeah, that's why. You didn't miss much. Except that his... He might do the expression again. Just like the other game. No, it won't. Does she have the same voice as the other game? ここのオーナーね。私は藤原優子。ここのオーナーね。ここのオーナーね。ここのオーナーね。ここのオーナーね。ここのオーナーね。ここのオーナーね。ここのオーナーね。ここのオーナーね。ここのオーナーね。ここ
Where's that cat? Where is the cat? There's no cat. Oh, maybe she's messing with it. I guess. <laughs> okay. I guess. Okay. 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 For the well-being of our pets, everything for the pets, the pets shall take over the world! Oh, that was a kitty. Okay. The pets every day keeps things under control. Why would it be out of control? Okay. Seems easy. I'm probably gonna fuck it all up. Okay. So are we supposed to be friends or rivals? Yep, for all of your clothes. Yoshi. I only say that because I don't know if we're not supposed to be rivals. Looking clueless. Wants me to click on this. Fill the bowl of the pet's favorite food. Tilt the unspecified analog stick. Fill the bowl of food. Stop tilting the food bag at the right time. Alright, this is kind of like cooking mama when you're trying to fill up the bowl with flour. Left and right, not up and down. I was expecting up and down. I'm used to the other game. Oh yeah, two stamps. I am sad.
してて。でちみさあ、ケージに戻りま。戻りま、だろま。はい。じゅん。I was taking pictures and then recording the whole damn thing. You don't want these to go on the internet. <laughs> Oh man, you're making noises I like. <laughs> I have decided that you are no longer my rival. I am interested in this. Okay, that was the face he was making before, after when we were being introduced, that I was talking about. Yep, got it all on tape. How much is this worth to you? <laughs> How much is it worth to you? I could I could send it to all your friends now. And he's like, what are your demands? And I'm like. I have no idea what my demands are. But you'll do what I say. <laughs> Or your friends will, will see this. Which actually might backfire for me. Because if I'm really interested in you, you, if you have like a friend that's interested in you, they might be, oh yeah, he's cute too, and be like, oh, mine. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, guys in Japan don't like to be called cute. Because, you know, they're scared. I like cute guys. Oh, yeah, I like cute guys. I'm not a person, I'm a plant. I'm not a person, I'm a plant. No, don't worry, just keep going. That's just more blackmail material for me. So, Saki Kikareta, the lucky Saki Kita Kotoa, Fadidaka, and Himitsni Stikreto. How much did how much is your down low worth to you? Yeah, and then it's like five, six, ten years later, we're married, and I'm like. I've been, you know, and then he's like, oh yeah, the, I, I checked your cell phone and found them videos. I'm like, oh yeah, those videos. I forgot about, I totally forgot about them. That's why we're married. I blackmailed you into it. But you know, now that we're married, I have to keep these because these are now precious memories. Oh, we're gonna get along. We're gonna get along, alright. Like butter on corn. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't read any of that. Where's the vlog? Yeah, I have no idea. <laughs> He's like, what the hell does that mean? Butter on corn? What am I supposed to be thinking? If you must know, I grew up in the South. So we have those euphemisms like butter on corn! Time passes and sword progressively. You work, you don't do anything. 
Use your time wisely and work as much as you can. I missed all of that. I didn't want to miss it. <laughs> I should just, I'm just completely fucking confused. Proper amount of food, which, like, I saw that first thing. I saw you glitching out over here. I see you glitching out over there. Do it again, I dare ya. Wait, no, that was a horrible cat. <laughs> Wait, is this real time? I used to be- I used to do be able to do a good kitten. My kitten has since died. Yosh. Ow! It's turned into like angry, uh, Flapjack. That, you know that cat from Flapjack? I don't- I don't think many people have watched that show. I haven't watched that show. I just saw a clip from it with that cat. Flapjack's like, hey, kitty. And the cat's like, meow, meow, meow. Hey, kitty, spring. And it's like this, this like demon cat. Let's get right to business. I don't like word evaluations. Frequency and quality of work. Mm -hmm. Let's get right to it. And of course, the CEO just sits on her ass and just collects our paychecks. We have to work, literally work our asses off to get paid more, and she's just like, I just have to sit here, and you're doing my work for me, because that's how CEOs work. So, <laughs> I'm bringing serious real-world politics to, like, a children's pet game. Earn stamps by playing the work minigames. The more stamps you have, the more you get paid! You can also gain Pup Purse points by clearing challenges. Pup's Purse of one Yan points can even be used to buy clothes and other apparel. So it's money. Like, we don't even get real money. Like, the other game gave us, like, real money. We get... points. And we use these... Points to buy things. We don't even get paid a salary we can use in the real world. Check out the available challenges before you begin. Please make note of the challenges found under the Anytime Challenges. They can be attended as much as you like and will eventually replenish. The challenge of replenish until are all five or are at the start of a new month. Open the menu and then either touch the challenges icon or press X. So when did we get paid? Glad I'm not the one that said it. I end of every day. That's nice. You'll be paid for today, of course. I look forward to that. Then, for now, you will learn a different job in the morning. What haven't we done yet? Register. So, say, Kai. And then no one's dipping from the register. Oh, yeah, that's 
And we serve our customers, the more customers they'll have in our shop. The more customers visiting means more chances of finding our pets a loving home. What is that look, Shun? I'm all like, yeah, let's go get our- Let's go get these pets to homes! And Shun's like, oh god. Playing minigames will increase the shop's popularity gauge, too. I can't use a physical, but more people will visit the shop. Shop as it increases. You can do shop related tasks via the pop ups near the register and product. Okay, and what is that? Look! Oh, seriously, dude, what the hell? Um. I'm looking for wrong direction. Ash? Let's see, have, I, have we gotten the, the thing yet? No. Shen, what's up with you, buddy? I'm buddy. Scanner to read barcodes. Angle the scanner so I can read the barcode. Four points for successfully scanning the barcodes. I suppose this would work better with motion controls. Or work worse with motion controls. Barcodes are really not that funny. Be that better be three stars. guy I see or are there gonna be other dudes that pop up like in uh, the animal hospital there's like three dudes that's good I'm not a complete fuck up on my first day Also, once again, they did not dub this, which is probably thankful. But then again, Axis games are like kind of greedy, so they save money on the dubbing and then they still charge $40 for the game. Like, until my games are even worse, they charge 50. And they don't have to do dubbing. All they have to do is translate the text. And, and sometimes they can't even do that right, because, you know, the, there's errors in the text, they change the... Like in, uh... What is it? Sakura Tani and Nord 9, both the games? Uh, Var Commons and Last Era, they fucked up the font, because they can't do vertical fonts properly i i think the font might want to do the the like written 
like how to describe it Ver the, the letters are vertical and then it goes downward but they want it rotated to the side to where all the letters are on their side going up which is it's like i don't know access games just they're just too hungry for money, but then again, that's every company. Only shop at night. Total work done. Oh, I get an only beauty cushion? Oh, Tiara? Konnichiwa, Haruji sama. Yes, thank you, Ren type. Making me feel like, um, pre para. I want that meat toy. Umeboshi onigiri. I don't know what rewards I, I got, but anyways. To buy new things. Let's see if they have, um, they don't have. They dress like a sprout, though. I have my black jeans though. Gotta have those. Black socks. Where are the boots? Tell me they got the boots. They don't got them. Oh, I have to buy my aprons. But Oh, it's still coon. Kun kun kun? Yeah, it's still kun kun. Alright, it's still giving me a you got stuff to do here. Huh? Oh, there we go. Wait, are these for dogs? Do I get a pet?
I kind of forgot how to do the challenges. Like, where to open them up and all that stuff. Oh, there's the meat toy. Give us more money. No. よろしくお願いします。よろしくお願いします。じゃあ、早速接客について説明をしよう。I thought it says we don't have a sacrifice service. I'm like, what do you mean we don't have a sacrifice service? Is that something other ones have? And they're like, oh, we don't have to sacrifice service. Well, no sacrifice service for me, I guess. なるべくお客さんの希望通りになるようにお客さんの希望通りになるように話を進めていくようにしてねなるべくお客さんの希望通りになるように話を進めていくようにしてねなるべくお客さんの希望通りになるように話を進めていくようにしてねなるべくお客
ブラッシングありがとうございましたああのグッドルーキングI really hate all these different brackets and stuff. That still isn't it. Is it just... Should be it. If not, I'll work on it later. Why is it in caps? There we go. I also got a new one that summons a rat. It's supposed to be some cheese there. I'll put the cheese there. Just imagine there's cheese there. I stole I stole a rat from Platy Pete. He said I could have it. Rats give me courage. Anyway, I'm taking Tai Chi home with me because his voice is cute. Uh huh. Anything for you, Tai Chi? <laughs> as long as you get in my car and go home with me. And I get to keep you in my basement. Oh, yeah, I forgot. That doesn't update unless I, uh. Must I select it? That's what I as expected. Pets and customers. You see, like, the pets are running the shop and then the customers are in the window. And the owner's like, what the hell? I'm like, oh, I thought it was this kind of pet shop. Okay, now we get our aprons. Breaks for people who don't want overtime. All right, new aprons. Let's see. Give me that green one. 
I can steal a shot. The, the, the managers, I can steal his. The PK friend. I'll take the green one. Doctor Mission. I was going to do this job, but can you do my job for me? Oh. Yeah, I'll feed the dog. Hi, Rentype. You still hiding? Hello? Hello? Rentype? Hello? Hello? Whatever. Yeah, I'd rather be feeding dogs than, like, doing stuff. Let's see how oh my god, flashing! Yeah, well, you're like... You take my numbers away from me. <laughs> Give me back my numbers. Normal pet feeding, which I, I guess that they uh, the numbers go away a lot longer, and then you get up to hard where it's just guess. Otsukare, sugoi na, sasuga na. No problem. You owe me later, and I'm still gonna blackmail you with your um. Your cute voice. You gonna talk to me? Talk to me! Okay. ちょっといいかな。お願いできそう。実は。does nobody have time to do their job in this place? Is there always yet another job out there? This is normal, what's hard, Blake? Yeah, that wasn't good. Still got three stars. Yeah, that was normal. Hey, Platy Pete, how goes? I stole your rat. I gotta fix the cheese. Otsukare-sama. I'm taking very good care of the rat. The rat it lives in a uh, 
an uh, upscale rat mansion. Actually, I could do that right now. Rat have a name. Hmm. There, the rat now has cheese. What are we gonna name the rat? I don't think I have to think of a name for the rat. That's a good question. The rat needs a name. Maybe the maybe the rat will tell me its name. I see a customer entering. never tell you their names for themselves exactly or their true name they'll give you like a, a... you know like a, a a name that like in some cultures like when you're first born you get like this terrible name to keep like the the demons and fairies away and they'll tell me like something like that so I can't use the real name against them I think the only thing I have left is the register. Yo, bye now. Let me see. Do I need to care for the cat? Um. Oh yeah. Let me feed kitty. background it's flashing so much what uh. much you are compelled to buy a pet like why did you come to a pet shop and we're gonna buy buy a pet no no I just I came to get a new collar for a pet you must buy another pet <laughs> Like, I just need some gerbil feed. Sorry, you now have a new gerbil. I don't want to go to the hard difficulty. Normal difficulty is kind of hard enough. You take my numbers away from me. in a children's pet game. Oh, 
Honestly, this kind of makes the stuff you do in uh, Animal Hospital, like, seem easy. Like, you lift the temperature gauge up to this, and you, you push this to find the thing, and this one's like, you gotta be fast. How's your, how's your reaction time? Not good! <laughs> Wait until you get to the hard mode. Okay, that was the hard mode. That wasn't so bad. You're evaluated every day in your paycheck and the um Russian cat IRL recent Yeah it is it is You're like sitting there and purring Y'all get all that fur out get a new cat and then you have two cats and then you have to brush them and then you have like four cats so, like, you get all that shitted fur, and, like, the more you brush the cat, like, the less fur you find around, and then, like, less allergies. Except, you know, if they don't want you to, like, brush their belly, and then they claw your hand out. Gotta look after the dog next. Yeah, you get paid every day, and you're evaluated every day, and your paycheck's based on your evaluation. Yay, I leveled up! I'm gonna steal that background one of these days. Rank up! I am now Fun Staff, from Shiny Staff. Yeah, I've seen cats that like them, and then some cats that are like, your hand is now death. It's... It... Yeah, I think it's just how the cat grew up. Uh, I watched Kitten Academy, and they usually, like, get the kittens, uh, what is it? Accentuated? Don't think that's the right word. To, like, belly, belly pets and stuff. And if they're not, like, attuned to that at a kitten age, then they're kind of like... It's a toss-up. Acclimated, that's the word. My brain- my brain threw the dictionary in, like, to this burning, uh... oil barrel. So it's like, words, there- if, if any, any of the words that fell out of the dictionary, those are the ones I get to use. Okay, we can only go shopping at night. See, I don't know what these do. Are they added to the shop or something? Got one. A blue flower head. And some money. Yeah, we don't get paid real dollars, we get paid in points. And we probably have to spend at the company shop. Yup, company script. Oh, I want to wear white. Uh, I want a blue one. I'll pick a blue one. Just 
looks like I'm so that's the fall. Yes. So there is a character in uh PSO 2 NGS. I think in Kavaris. His name is Cristobal. Every time I see him, I'm like, San Cristobal? Turns out the shop is a virtual experience commissioned by Seetson. Like, we're in the shop and then the facade just melts down and we see that the, uh, the manager is a working Joe and Shun is also a working Joe and it's like... Oh no. take all of these and then when you turn to the register there's just a face hugger on the register robocats for everyone on the station yes i think i'm gonna play like another day of this just to or what well, Maybe the April 4th. And call it a video. Yep. Face huggers are good at checking counterfeits. They are indeed good at that. Minna, ohayo. See, this is, this is the owner sitting comfy at home with their little plant, and here I am at the pet store getting her her money. Like, she gets the money, we get points. Different tasks today. Oh, what could those be? Wait, I don't even think Mai is, is the manager. I think she's just a senior employee. So you see the guy with blue hair? I have blackmail on him. I totally was like filming him making cute, cute voice at a cat. Or at least I say I, I got the, um... I got it. In the game, they just kind of, like, brush it off. But I'm like, no, that's blackmail. He tries to pull one over on me. I'm like, I could upload this to the internet. And eventually he's gonna be like, fine, upload it to the internet. And then he's gonna have, like, a billion fans. I'm like, oh no, that backfired. <laughs> We're having you try something new today. Oh no, we're the pets. Vacuuming and grooming. House no skillsを仕事の合計三つをお願いしようかな. I seriously read, and we also have to crate train you, and I'm like, there it is, and then I'm like, wait, no, my brain's just adding words now. I'm trying to make this weird. I shouldn't be making this weird. Get in the crate, Shun! It's your color! Alright, for dogs, you can usually just put a treat in there and I'll just go right in. For cats? You either, like, you leave it open and then wait till they want to go in there, or you're just gonna have to, like, put it on its end and pick the cat up and just dump the cat in there. Yeah, 
お客さんにお渡しするときにも必要なことなんだ。You either gotta embrace it all or make it a little weird, yes. My cat, like, I think I told the story. She liked to shove herself under the couch, and there was only like two, two and a half inches to get under that couch. And she would just shove herself under there, and I'm like, cat, what are you doing? I, we thought she, like, ran away for good one time, and it's like. No, she was squished under the couch. And like, I tried to get her, but I, you know, my, my arm's pretty small, but that, no, it was way too small. And we just had to wait until she crawled out. And it looked like it was like you're unrolling a tube of toothpaste the way she just like squirted out of there. Like, like it was nothing. And I'm like, okay, cat, whatever. Yeah, we used to have a carrier that opened at the top, which is pretty handy. Oh, yeah, that's, that's always her. Yeah, cats, cats tend to get into, like, weird spots you didn't even know you had in your house. And kittens especially. I saw one that the kitten was in the, uh, Kleenex box. And a shoe. I'm like, you're never gonna find that kitten. Unless it starts viewing, and then you'll find it. That's why it's important to make sure we crate train our pets. That's a lot more important than it looks that we crate train them yesterday and get in the crate. Wait. With that said, let's start training. Maybe there are some cats on the Sevastopol and I haven't found them yet. There is a message to, of one guy telling to his wife that's like, get the kids. I'm not sure Adidas says get the kids and get the cat and get out of there. But I don't think you actually see him, the wife, or the cat. I'm thinking the only reason they say get the cat is because an alien, there was Jonesy. Which it's still like, do the aliens, can the aliens actually use cats as like a, a breeding ground? Because it seems like the only time it's like a human size or bigger. Uh, I think it's J O N S E Y. At least I think that's what I've seen it as. Yeah, I think it was like, you think the cat's been infected? Because when the alien was like sniffing the cat and the cat's just like, whatever. Like, oh, then the alien somehow infected the cat, even though that's not the way it works. Unless the alien was like, man, cool cat. I want a cat like that. Eat the pet that go to go inside the crate. Press press A to praise the pet when it goes completely inside the crate. Uh, time the praise right to score more points. You will fail if you praise the pet too soon or too late. The see this sounds like the eye drops. Get hit in the crate. What button? Oh.
I just gotta wait until its uh, tail passes that blue barrier. Defeated Ripley, it would have adopted Jonesy. Yeah, and you just, um. The aliens. The second movie, you just, you know. The alien cruising around in the. What's the. Well, the escape pod from this Nostromo and, and the cat. And uh, then we can have, you know, like a cool adventures of, like, alien and cat. Zeno and Jonesy. Yeah, it's the Zeno and Jonesy show. It's for kids. I I did great. I've never been praised in my life. Yeah, what a movie. Ah. It's that face again. I love his face. Look at that face. Tonight it's 6 uh, Pacific Standard Time. They did a Robocop show for kids and I don't see why they actually were did a or were going to do a cartoon alien show. I forget if it just got cancelled before it came out, or it actually did come out. <laughs> but they were gonna do one. They had, like, toys and everything. And you're like, what the hell? I mean, I think even Robocop was, was, was R-rated, and they had a kid show. Yeah, um... The failed aliens cartoon and the Kenner toys it inspired. There's like something over at Comics Alliance. Of course, like the aliens look a little toned down. Like, oh, you don't, you don't want to give the kids nightmares. She really shouldn't be saying y'all because she ain't from Osaka, but anyways. Cause usually Osaka gets like the y'all accent. Pet Caragade Caragade goes up as a train care for the pet. Wow, I just sort of like slipped into this accent. The higher the gauge, the more likely it will attract customer attention. Let's go fishing, everybody. This is the voice I use for the fishing master. You can see where a pet's care level is by looking at how many paint stars it has. They're actually red. Oh yeah, I found some screen grabs. It looked like how Tiny Toons would have parodies, parodies aliens. Exactly. They looked at each other. They're a perfect match. Gotta take them to the bonding chamber. This is the one! The bonding chamber! Yeah, yes. This is now Shin Megami Tensei. We're gonna bond them together and we're gonna get a stronger pet out of it. We're gonna make her into a cat girl! Or we're gonna make the cat into a, a felper. Either way, I'm sure we can we can sell them. 
Or send them on dungeon adventures. It'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Oh, it's a dog. We're gonna turn her into our puppy girl. Or, uh, uh... Uh, well, wizardry doesn't have dog people. Yes, they do. They have werewolves. She'll be like a were... Shiba Inu. Sure, kid, just pony up the dough. Did you talk to your mom or dad already? You need to get mom right now. She has a cute cherry shirt. <laughs> Mommy, did you find some? One. Nice. She sent her kid into the pet shop to pick up dudes. This game looks very sweet and here I am bringing up aliens. No, it's fine! They made a cartoon and everything! It's fine! Aliens are for kids now. Xenomorphs for kids. What the Shiba? Mommy, get things ready at home? Okay. <laughs> they shouldn't get in the crate. You're going. To, you're going home. Yeah, Shiba dogs are not. I hear they're kind of rough. They take a certain kind of owner. And the mom's like, "No, this is my dog." It's like, well, my mommy's hogging my dog, and it's like, well, just lost your dog, kid, to your mom. <laughs> yes, exactly. Shebas are kind of rough. Helpful for sure, and she just turned 10 years old. Let's take good care of them! Thank you very much, I'll take good care of them. By the way, do you have any tips on how to best raise them? We've done our research, but I thought I should ask professionals too. Uh. Frontline or canine advantix with a please. Dump food in their mouth. Take them outside to run around on occasion. They'll be fine, I'm sure. シバイヌちゃん。いい人と出会えてよかったな。シバイヌちゃん。けど、正直ちょっと寂しいよな。さっきまでお世話してたこと。I the sugar gliders? Is that what they are? The chinchillas? Like, even hamsters aren't exactly what people think they are. Like, I went to look into, like, caring for hamsters because I was playing hamster games, and it's like... They're not just, like, rats that you buy. They're... they're... they need, like, different... caring. Well, I mean, even rats and mice need, like, like more than just stick them in a cage, give them food and water, and clean the cage. They need, like, other things, too.
私たちのお仕事はワンニャンとお客さん両方を幸せにすること Hamsters are both very smart and very very not smart They're escape artists but they will also get themselves into trouble and need help to get out of it like the hamsters we used to have at school back when I was in middle school, it would constantly like just leap off the desk. And it's probably because the poor thing was just scared to death. But that it said in my mind that I didn't want a hamster because they would just fling themselves off of anywhere and I didn't want to be responsible if hamster just flung killed itself jumping off of things. Which they, I learned later in physics that, like, because hamsters and mice have uh, way less, they have a less terminal velocity and the force of them impacting the, the ground is less, which won't harm them as much, but it could be potentially harmful. Yeah, I don't think hamsters are good for, like, children, like, in a school setting. Then again, I don't really know what animal is good for kids. I saw, uh, I forget what it was. It was like a, a video of this rat on like the third or fourth floor. It was really high up. It just jumps off the balcony and you see it go flying and it, you can hear kind of a splat when it hits the, the concrete, but it just takes off running like. Well, he just like just nothing. Like the rat was just fine. I'm like, rat, are you okay? That was like a third story, fourth story fall. Sad to see him leave, but the goal is to find him a good home. Yeah, they do the stem fall thing of spreading out their weight. My parts love them means I found a pet to love handling the pet. Handing the pet off to them means that the pet will leave the shop, but finding them a good home or need some work stamps. Bring together as many pets and customers as you can so they can both find happiness as you put them in the bonding chamber. <laughs> I thought we were supposed to learn vacuuming. お客さんの中にはお店にいないようなこう希望する人もいるんだ。I mean, I take it like maybe rats are built in a certain way because if they're picked up by like hawks and stuff and they can manage to wiggle free, it's going to be a long drop to the like ground and then you know, hopefully they'll survive. So, they might have some anatomy that helps them survive big balls. So, what's another task can give me, but I need y'all to handle waitlisting too. For signing someone up to like waitlist and press A. Be able to see exactly what kind of pet the customer is looking for. Call a customer when we get a pet that matches our ideal pet's description. New pet order. But in that instance, I was like, nope, hamsters aren't for me. But mice, like the brown mice, are really smart. And I really like brown mice. Matchmaker, matchmaker, make me a match. Stick some flammable phosphorus on the end of a stick. Here's your match! Oh, not like that. I order a bunch of lizards and they're like, what? Wanyan, not whatever sound lizard makes. Can I choose any of them? 
ただ予約があったときは希望通りの子を選ぶようにするといいよ。Her mouth doesn't move, it's been t o l i n g with them. You're scrolling through, and it's like toy poodle, chihuahua, short domestic short hair, long hair, Persian, and then you see a picture of some dude. And you're like, and it's like domestic short hair, and it's like, you know, he has like a short, short hair, and it's like. Yup, Shun, get in the window. All right, what pet do I want? Wait, I have to spend my money on buying pets for other people? What kind of what kind of business is this? I see the one you want. You use it later. You buy them from a breeder, I guess. That's like the worst kind. Like, it would be like you get them. It would be nice if you just have like this. Well, maybe not buy them. You pay their adoption fee from the local ASPCA, and so you just get like a mixed bag, and then you're like try to match them up to people. And hand them off to customers until their cage has at least one star. Wow, that's low bar. That's our customer ready only after you prepare them for handoff. Yeah, and you know, we might. It'd be nice to have customers that, like, I just want the ugliest mutt you can find with, like, the worst temperament. And so you get the ugliest dog with the worst temperament, and then they find their forever home. The order this time around will not cost any pups per point. Please choose one cute pet friend you want to bring in. Okay, that that's a missing no cat. <laughs> we got a missing no cat. We got a toy poodle, a chihuahua, Scottish full dachshund, another toy poodle, Russian blue that's not missing no. I feel compelled to buy the missing numb pet. Come on, kitty. Let's, let's go home. And then, like... <laughs> take the cat home and then when I open the door like I have a chair from the ceiling but like part of it is like flipped around and then copied over a little bit and then like the couch is like half of it sideways and like a bits of the lamp are stuck in it and I'm like yeah that's what you get when you bring a glitch cat home. <laughs> Halfway to Wobble Dogs. Oh man, I've seen some Wobble Dogs. Like, someone made a Wobble Dog centipede, if I'm remembering correctly. And then someone made a Wobble Dog loaf, it was just like it had no legs. But I tried to play Wobble Dog, but I thought I thought it was just too cruel sometimes. Yeah, it's great chaos. It's like I I recommend Wobble Dogs for like for for animal scientists like that want dogs with no legs, but somehow they can survive forever. It's like that game uh, Creatures. 
with the Norns. It's like that game, but they're dogs. And they lay eggs? What do they lay eggs? What? Yeah, I played Wobble Dogs, but I kind of felt it was too cruel for some of the Wobble Dogs. Like, your existence is a nightmare. I kind of want to, like, put you out of your misery, but that makes me feel bad. But I think you can, like, freeze them or something. Kind of like in Monster Rancher. I forget. I'm trying to remember. It's been a while. Which doesn't feel so bad. The creature was supposed to be the original AI pet game. Like, they're supposed to learn and they have DNA. Um, and you can breed traits into them or breed traits out of them. There is a whole creatures online community still to this day it was a very fascinating game when it came out i mean it still is a very fascinating game because i haven't seen any other game like it really the owner might let you do more around here more work for for the same amount of pay i bet I would say it, for what they were saying, it did work, but it was back in, like, the 90s. So it was, like, very, the scope was still very, it had that limited scope to it. And of course, since then, people have kind of hacked the game, made mods for the game to expand it beyond what it is. I just kind of like Wobble Dogs is like, it feels kind of like creatures. But also like something else entirely. How are you gonna sign up for more work? Also, here. This is Ribbon. Put that on your head, Shun. Oh, we have to justify that stuff. Put the ribbon on your head, Shun. I got blackmail. But I do like... I have wanted to make a game myself so that has arbitrary um, variables like with the shapes and stuff like usually breeding games are like they have a set like oh you get these wings or those horns but you know like this is arbitrary like takes points from this thing and that thing and like puts them together to make something new I've been fascinated with genetic as a kid. Oh, it's like you know June or wait Shun with the bow would actually probably look good. Yeah, morphing the models kind of thing. I want to say Jade Cocoon on the P PlayStation did that, but I'm not certain. I think it was like it said it did it, but it didn't exactly do it. Like, you can have blend shapes, and it takes this blend shape and that blend shape and kind of tweens them.
Trying to think of spore. Once again, everybody's dumping their Java onto me. Oh yeah, the barcode scanner. I think a spore. How do you remember spore? to a point and then I think it was when you get into the villages uh, that it just stopped being interesting that some things had some creature blending you can do but never made it to the final game yeah they kind of promised the moon and can only deliver moon dust but it was still an interesting game like, until, like, the village part, and then I kind of got bored with it because it was just fighting and stuff, and I'm like, no, I want to breed things. Space Agent Brain Off Experience. I don't remember the space stage. Yeah, I probably enjoyed the space stage if it wasn't, um, if it wasn't the village thing. So stage to space, yep. knockoff video games like knockoff spore let's get around in the creators is more fun than more fun than most of the games sally love making all sorts of spaceships and seeing what creatures people made oh yeah that's always a fun part Oh, this is in the, 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 uh, hospital game. But, I, yeah, we don't have a front one in the hospital game. Yeah, Spore with a more feasible scope. Yeah, or, yeah, make one thing good. Yeah, this is different from the, um, hospital game. For the hospital game, you have to rotate the two analog sticks. Sticking out of the, the, the bubbles. 
But you know this is a cat. A cat would never be- would never subject itself to this. You'd have to get, like, the reinforced gloves and... Well, I don't know, it's a kitten. It might like it. If it's been water acclimated. But, like, a normal cat would be like... Just nope right on out of there. Feels like it could have been a DS game with the stylish brushing and scrubbing. Yeah, there was a lot of- I think there was uh, a Akogari Girls Collection Wanyan pet shop on the, the 3DS and the DS. It goes all the way back to the Game Boy Advance. I think there was a Game Boy Advance game like Pets Pet Shop or something. Which is the which is an Akogari Girls Collection Wanyan game. But since Ubi and Ubisoft dumped their pets line, uh Axis Games like picked up the Akogari Girls Collection games. Which I got intrigued by like the hamster game that everyone wants to make fun of. That says he cage too small, which is supposed to be the cage is too small. Like Pets on the Wii, Pets 2 on the Wii is the sequel to The Dog Island. So Are Pets, Cats 2, Pets, Dogs 2? It's a sequel to The Dog Island, but only on the Wii and the PS2. <coughs> and A Hamster's Life on the GBA is Hamster Club 3, which actually has a manga. And so I just kind of got into shovelware games, or I guess they're shovelware, I don't... Kids, the pets, kids games, and I was like, what other kids games like from Japan that were translated and put into English? And this was one of them I found, and I'm like, it's a chill game, and I'm not feeling the best. So. I can turn all my brain cells off and play this game. But like with the dinosaur game, it's uh, I have to like watch out for encounters and with the fishing game, it's fishing game's been frustrating because I haven't been able to catch the right size carp. And I think I might have to raise the carp and let it go, which I want to do off screen. I'm seriously wondering if other hot dudes are gonna show up. I'm pretty sure the hospital one has, I would maybe not a dating element, but a friends element. Or it could be just like you just make friends with everybody. But they gave you three dudes. In a girls game, and that's- that's telling me you, you end up with one of them, maybe. Yeah, like your little sibling has a, um... Anime disease, and you have to go off and cure it. And you get to choose, like, what gender you are and what gender your sibling with anime disease has. And the second one has a, involves a magic hat. But I kind of want more games like that, you know, like... Mm, I want to say simple, but not exactly simple, but you know, just the storyline isn't save the world 
You're infecting everyone with my Blorvo sickness. <laughs> Put the Blorvo in the bed. Wait, no. why am I hearing other noise? Such a smelly towel and a party of oh. people have suddenly appeared. Hi. Oh no, the chaos. Whoops. I forgot I had a stream on. Pause. Whoops. That was Hoons, by the way. That was Hoons' stream. Which, they're a... They're a VTuber. I don't know what animal they are. But they're some kind of... Rodent? Don't cross the streams! Don't cross the streams! But at least, but but maybe we defeated the Stay Puff Marshmallow Man by crossing the streams. Anyway, it's been two hours, so I'm be I'm I'm be calling this video. Can, can you tell I grew up in the South? I wasn't born in the South. I just grew up there because of reasons. Because of the Navy. Because your parent was in the Navy. Uh, we are actually going to raid out. Um, a switch to powering down. Let's see if Ren Type's gonna do his job. Switch to powering down. Ren Type's not gonna do his job. Uh, what button was powering down? Uh, switch the powering down because I forgot the button. This one? No. That one? No. Help! I don't know my own thing! Wait, no, that's not it. There! I managed to get there by myself. The rat has found the cheese. And it is filled you with determination. We are... Well, no, the person I was going to raid is not streaming anymore. Um... Probably just stop streaming. So, uh... Who do I want to raid? I got two people in mind. I'm gonna raid the person with less viewers because, like, you know, help them build their stream up. Um... There we go. We're gonna raid Kami Anya, who is playing uh, Monster Prom. Which is a very excellent game. I have played all three of them, and every single one of them is is are, is is great. Recommend. Uh, ten out of ten. Ten out of ten out of ten Mothman. Just hop over there. There we go. That should have. It should have. Released you to the horde. 